<laughs> hey everybody, go support. Who is this? <laughs> I bore Rob in my background. Bore Rob. You bore Rob. That's People don't say. get his humor. I get his humor. With a Y. Hey everybody. Don't forget subscribe to Ebor Rob. Don't forget subscribe to Ebor Rob. He's back. And I'm yeah. Back filming the cops. Put Ebor Rob. Right. Right. I'm All chilled his... out about it now, man. I'm really chilled out about it. And uh, you don't gotta always own own the cops, bro. You gotta let them. Just tonight. Just go subscribe to Ebor Rob. He's important to this community. He's helped so many channels. A while back, I don't know how many of you guys are new that watch this, but Ebor Rob, man. Strong person in this community. This is the chance for the cars. I need to put this to the top. 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 That's weird, man. You too, dude. That's cool. cool. See my wiener? No, I don't. Bro. Okay. All right. Make yourself a turn and go down the street and never come back. <clears throat> Do you have a band aid? Failure. Do you have a voice, sir? Do you guys have any hand sanitizer? We don't have a voice. Nope. We have a voice. Aren't you supposed to, Corporal? No. How about a band aid? You have a band aid? Hey, can, can I, can I get in there? Please, man, I need to be in there. I got something to say. All right, sir. Go ahead. What do you got to say, sir? Now I'm about to make a move. I feel the envy around me. They smile in my face and talk shit behind me. But that's all right. I'm still going to spread my wings. I hope it's not too late to catch up with my dreams. Like BB, so I'm thinking the thrill is gone. See, I procrastinated getting in this game too long. But every day, I'm crafting on a brand new song. And for some live in your heart, then the beat goes on. All right. And the beat goes <laughs> and on. on and on and on. What's your yeah. name, sir? Huh? What's your name? My name is Donald. Thank you, Donald. Yeah, Thank man, you for I, sharing I that. You, I, I wasn't just coming at you like that. No, no, I know. That's why I give you time. <laughs> yes, sir. And that's why I didn't put in the video because man, I ain't done, bro. I didn't get myself put in there, bro. Uh, I'm gonna show internal affairs that for shit. You think they enjoyed their coffee? I don't think so. No, they didn't. <laughs> that's the two that went inside. Bro, Rice Krispies shit, bro. Everybody <laughs> subscribed to Rice Krispies, bro, but uh Ebo Rob, I mean, welcome back, brother. Welcome hey, back. I appreciate you. Guys. We needed you, bro. I don't know, man. I'm not gonna be a conspiracy dude, I guess, but I got my own piece, bro. Like, I know. Yeah. I just know. I know stuff. I am a woken citizen. We drink Woka Cola. I drink Woka Cola. <laughs> Hell yeah. I don't know who the guy in the truck is, though. Never seen him. Oh, they boogied on out of here. They left. Yeah. <laughs> Drive of shame. Okay, so this is what we accomplished out of this. Officer Loser. Ventra and the two buddies, they left their parking space. Tisk, tisk. These guys are going to sit here. This is jerk. And we got them to stop oh. drinking the coffee. Hey. Hey. To me, that's good. I appreciate you guys helping me get them back to work, man. Yeah. Go. What is this, an alley? Can I walk down this? 
Yeah, yeah now. Nah. Don't give them anything. I don't know. They can ask me to leave. Right. Don't do it, bro. I was on my way out. Yeah, no, no, don't do it. Drive of shame. Drive of shame. Oh, we got the drive of shame. We got officers to stop drinking coffee. I mean, we got officers to stop drinking coffee. We got officers You better be careful with my truck. Be careful with my truck. Truck number is 5099. Coward Government accountability, sir, for we the people. <laughs> Welcome. Lights crispy here, Ebor City. Welcoming back, Ebor Rob. I thought we didn't chase them up. Was he bothering you, sir? Yeah. Oh, oh wait, no. He's violating this man's rights, I think. Is he dealing with you right now, sir? About what? He made the guy turn right. He's not going to violate your rights. Hey, guys, he's trying to violate this homeless man's rights. What's the emergency? He's got him stuck. All right. All right. Yeah, you were just telling us. Yeah. Here we go. All right, so we're going to document this tyrant right here in the Ebor section of Tampa. This guy parks in the middle of the street with a sober citizen. I can't do that. Oh no, he just relieved himself? Oh, how gross. Let's get him out of our sight, right? Who said that? What is no. your name? badge number, sir? Name a badge number? John, do you have any what questions? What is your police business, man? John, do you have any questions? Were you just trying to embarrass him by telling us that? Being so helpful now. I'm sorry. Well, that's 411. You can go down there if you want to, but you can also go to TPD District 3. It's near MLK and 22nd Street. Do you know where that is? I'm sorry. I've been down around and I don't know what's Hey, John, man, you pissed me the public, man. <laughs> Look, I'll kick your ass, boy. If you Tell go down right there now. Monday through Friday business hours, they can help you out. If you also go to Centennial Park, she's also often down there as well. Do you have any other questions? Well, not right, right, not right now. Tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow's Monday. It's a business day. We don't even know what day it is. Go to see now. Look at him. got all timers. MLK. Yep, that's correct. I don't know Anything what you're else? trying to project it is. Well, you're totally wrong. He's asking me. These questions. are the best but cops I appreciate that. in Tampa, Florida. Anything else? Are they? Yes, they are. Are you all right? So. Yeah. All right, God bless. Well hey, Matheson. 
killed. Matheson, help. Help. Matheson, help. May I have some hand sanitizer, please? You don't have any hand sanitizer in your cruiser? May I have a band aid, please? No band aid either. Failure. Are we. Right on. Please don't be like this guy just oh, harassing they, homeless people in the badge. I mean, many other bad. jobs out there, bro. Up, you know? Ooh, uh, the guy over here? I'm right here. Just, he came out and told us, oh, he just evacuated. You might want to watch your step. Trying to embarrass the dude. He's a human uh, being, bro. You hear, and now he yeah, just got the other guy against man, him. So he didn't get a ticket now his court. friend's yelling at him because of what the police officer said. He saved his life from getting you know, that ticket, he's, man. You know that. What, 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 what's that's, he, uh, that's kind of instigating. What, we don't know now, man. We, we, we don't answer any questions. Now, I'm going to ask. Are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, uh, okay. That's what okay. I'm going to ask. But honestly, sir, like, I live in Ibor my whole life. And what's going to happen is is they get tickets that they can't, you know what I'm saying, to go to court. I and then even saying. even if they plead guilty, they get a $275 court fee. They They're never going to get a license. They suspend your license for that stuff, man. Yeah, That's I how you create homeless people. Please. Yeah, hey, yeah, I, I got yeah. something to ask you too, man. Please, Please do not take Officer of Provenza's lead ever. Be your own person, bro. That's he, what another job is for. He's a good officer? Yeah, Provenza's good. All right, go to Ebor Rob and watch the video I just put out. Let's see if he's a good officer at the end of the video where he says, He wouldn't have come from California. No. He wouldn't have come from Philly. I wouldn't have crossed the bridge to back him up if he was a good officer. Well, we what? saw the tyranny. Don't I'll be a tyrant. What? We expose tyrants, but we allow stars to shine. Do you have any hand sanitizer, sir? No, I ran out. Oh, I, I, right. I used all of it today. But right. I was going to say, I see your point about, you know, like, Homeless people not being able to afford, like, you know, like the fines and stuff that come yeah. with tickets. Yeah, like, help them. That, that give, makes them sense. give them $275 worth of service. It's more than that. It's like connecting with the community, you know? Like, yeah. getting in there and, 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 showing, and, and showing trust, building trust. You want to build that trust with the community. Every time you come up to somebody and say, oh, you know, you do uh, do what I say, I, I need to search you, you smell yeah. like something, or create probable though. cause, that makes people not trust you guys, you know? Yeah, that's and a good point. It's like these guys harassing the homeless. Makes your job more dangerous. Man. He's earning hate. Yeah, I, I can see what you're saying. I can see what you're yeah. saying. Because at the end of the day, like, you know, if you do give a homeless person a citation or something like that, and they'll go pay and they can't afford it, and we give another homeless guy, another homeless guy, it kind of creates that cycle. It's not, not even, I, not even I, just I a homeless guy. Look at a guy. You know what 275 can get them? I'm going to tell you what a $275 court ticket can get them. Um, a room in a rooming house for a month. Yeah, I'm talking about Yeah. We have a friend who saw Jump Out Boys get out. He starts filming them from the parking lot of a church. They come up to him, covering their face, saying, let me see your ID. He's like, why? Uh, you just didn't come to a complete stop at that stop sign. He's on his bicycle. They took him to jail. He lost two days of his liberty for that. For An undercover narcotics detective arrested a man for not coming to a complete stop on his bicycle. You know, a lot of times for stuff like that, to be honest, a lot of times, it's because they've been like watching that person for a while. They may have done maybe a hand to hand transaction. I'm not saying that's, that's what he's No, no. But sometimes, usually what they do is they watch that person for a while, they find legal reasons to stop them, and they try to go from there. They were, yeah. they were targeting him because he watches them. He was on his way to go review some. I think you just gave the definition of stalking. Like, they saw you, <laughs> they saw you back in the day make a hand to hand, no, and then this what, week, what I'm a pretext like, crime. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no. no. Well, so they, if they see an actual hand to hand transaction, instead of trying to stop him right there, that's why I said, you know, do more hand to hand transactions. Yeah, well, but it's actually good to have, 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 have to see what they pass, man. You can't just uh, assume. You right. could be a, he could be his best friend or something. But that's why some, some officers are specific experience towards that. Like they're trained gears towards suspicious that. Suspicious and reasonable articulate suspicion is oh, two different suspicions things. not a crime. Well, no, yeah, yeah. I'm not even talking about, I'm not even talking about like, you Mere know, suspicion reasonable is suspicious. Not a crime. suspicion. Yeah, I'm talking about like actual probable cause to where they yeah. see a. Uh, this hand man, hand this man is clean and he has two jobs, and that's what I was getting to. He's been offered. <laughs> he's he's been offered by uh, by the state uh, thirty days and it'll go away. That man has gonna, is gonna lose his two jobs if he takes that, and then you create a homeless person. That's what I'm saying. It's like he didn't commit a crime. He was just keeping you guys accountable and making your job safer, and they retaliated on him. Yeah, I can see what you're saying. Yeah, but that's dirty Polk. Polk County Sheriff. The Imperial Polk County. Polk County? Imperial Polk County. That's what it's called, believe it or not. It's it's on their logos, on their cruisers and everything. 
Alright, well, it was good talking to you guys. I think you I Honor your oath. Um, Y'all stay safe. Okay. Alright, man, I appreciate good that. See you too. To no Papa Cleo? You heard? What was he saying? <laughs> to say that public that tea. Just we don't make it. Well, the first thing you said, it sounded like Haitian Creole. What's yeah. That? You speak Creole? A little bit. I How speak French, but. Where are you from? My mother's Dominican. Okay, okay. okay. Yeah. Were you, were you born and raised in the. In the... No. I was born in America. Yeah, but you, 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 you say a little too, a little too right. Like, 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 like so you do you speak Creole? Yeah, I'm by Creole. Right on. Yeah, but when you right say on. that, I love it. Tell me about it. Cool. <laughs> do you say more for you? Oh, yeah, I can see you, man. Okay, that's cool. What's your name and badge number? Uh, Ricardo. I'm Ricardo. Ricardo? Ricardo. Badge uh, number? Oh, what's badge number? 394. 394. 394. You seem like a great officer. You seem like you're I'm young and you're fresh and, 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 and look, these older guys, man, don't follow their lead. Leave a comment below about this guy. You be you. Don't be afraid to be like held down because you're a good because you're a good guy or something. Yeah. You know? well, that's why when I came, that's why I came. That's why after he left, I still stay and talk to you guys. You know hey, I'm Ricardo, saying? you got a business card? I do, but it's not like professional like other guys. It's like oh, basic. Okay, forget it. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, I'll take one. Yeah, yeah, you, got yeah. you got it? All right, all right, make sure I here, Yeah, some guys got like the professional stuff. Stay professional too, man. Yeah, man. For us, we the people, bro. For you. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I'm sure. I don't break the law, so I'm okay. You you probably commit three felonies a day, and you don't even know it. All right, so I try my best There's so right, many right, laws on the books that we don't even know about that they just Saint decide Florida. not to enforce. S T F L E U R. It is. There's an entire book I'm reading about. <laughs> I appreciate that, man. Right, I appreciate it. Right, I'm going to be on the road, so you cars on. All right, Messi, right. Pavot Red. Stay safe, all right? Be safe. Live safe. Down to your oath. All right, so leave a comment below about that guy. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. They, cool right there, Officer Ricardo St. Fleur. You can get back to work. That, that's unfortunately, I'm the police, and my job is to walk on these streets.